What's up guys? So a lot of people have been asking where I'm staying So I'm going to do a Bali house tour and you can see where I'm staying First things first, if you live in Bali You need a motorcycle <laughs> So you walk in and you walk down this pathway And that's the Airbnb that we're staying in And right now we're just a little bit outside of Ubud One of my favorite parts is this like awesome living wall so it's all flowers and leaves it's really nice you walk in the front door and it's a big door it's funny because in bali the doors are like 10 times shorter than they would be in canada but yeah you walk in and you have like all glass mirrors little place to put your stuff and this is the dining room table and then I really like these lights I'll turn them on for a sec so that you guys can see but this is where I like you would eat dinner oh. you can't really see right now because it's too bright and past the dining room table is this beautiful kitchen and we have these concrete kitchen counters which are so nice concrete like for the fridge area. Nice fridge. Not that much in it. And then have like all your, I don't know, what do you call this? Dinnerware, eating stuff is on here. Fin tanks. Stools, you can have the bar night. And then like my favorite part about it is that we have this like whole open space with all the mirrors. You can see um, the rice fields all over there, which is really cool. There's a lady right there. Now, follow me down the stairs. This is like the living area where you just hang out. There's a nice, big, L-shaped couch. It's got the drone, you need that in every living room. And then we have the washroom over here. It's really dark to be honest. I don't know, can you see me? Yeah, okay. So we have this like dark areas for the washroom, the downstairs washroom. Wave. I mean the sink is right there. And then the washroom is right here. Ow. <laughs> but yeah, that's the washroom. And now you can all of these doors here. All of these doors open for these windows for you. They're all doors and they open. And then you come outside. So you come outside and you have an infinity pool that you can swim in and it's really nice. It's actually cold, which is hard to find in Bali because all the pools seem to be like, like a sauna. They're so hot. And then you walk over here. This is the outdoor shower, so like, if you're by the pool, you don't want to go all the way upstairs. There's a nice shower right here outside, and it's nice. So yeah, now we're going to go upstairs. This is just like a free window, but you have to be careful because if you're, you know, drinking too much, you might fall out of there. Because of this bridge, you've got like 20 foot ceilings right here, and it's really nice. So now you walk into this part of the house and here is a washroom and like the funny part is that there's these screens so it literally feels like you're taking a pee outside. Um, I really like the sink, it's really nice. Flow, water flow. Um, and then this is where you take your showers. So we walk in, and this is where you do a shower. And there's like a nice sink area, and yeah, it's nice. And then this is like the guest room. It's kind of messy right now, sorry about that. You walk in and you have two bunk beds that are twin size and a desk. And you have 
a uh, little storage area. And then you open up this door and you're on the balcony and you get a beautiful view of the pool from up here. And the rice fields right over there. And then a nice couch to hang out on. Don't go there. Put clothes on. What? Well, it's a shared balcony so you can get into the big room over here. And this is the big room, nice big bed, and some storage space, and right out the window you can just look at the beautiful living wall and some rice fields. Thanks for watching my house tour. If you guys liked it, let me know and leave a comment below and I'll do another one. The hardest thing for me to do is to get Hi. you to know me.